Hi everyone, Jason from Makera here with another Carvera Air tutorial. And in this one, we're looking at how to change the tool or swap out the bit on your Carvera Air desktop CNC. The Carvera Air has a unique quick tool change system that allows you to swap your bits without needing any additional tools or wrenches. This makes loading tools or the probe or other accessories easy and quick, whether it be before you start a job or for tool change mid job too. So let's look at how this tool change system works. You can do this with the dust shoe on or off, but I've removed it so it's easier for you to see in this tutorial. First, carefully hold the bit that's currently loaded, if one is loaded, around the bit collar. Next, lower the tool change lever all the way to release the bit from the spindle collet. With the bit released, you may remove it from the spindle, and be careful as the bits are sharp and it will fall out of the spindle if it's left unsupported. You can then insert your new bit, loading it all the way up to the bit collar as a stopping point to ensure that it's loaded fully into the spindle. Then you can raise the tool change lever to lock this new bit in place. And as mentioned, you can use this tool change system for loading your bits, loading the wired probe, or even the laser module too, as shown in our other tutorials. You can also replace the spindle collet so that you can load bits with shank diameters from three millimeters to 6.35 millimeters or eighth inch to quarter inch too. And when it's time for a tool change mid job, the Carvera Air will automatically pause and prompt you that it's time to change your bit. This is done in the controller app and by sounding a beep at the machine and adjusting the LED light bar in the machine to tell you which tool is needed as well. Once you've changed your tool mid job, you can confirm this change to continue manufacturing by either pressing the button on top of the Carvera Air or by continuing using the digital button shown in the controller app. And while they're not required, Bit collars do make loading the tools a little bit easier as they can be inserted to a certain point and the bit collar acts as an end stop to ensure that your bit's been loaded fully and correctly into your Carvera Air CNC. You can install and remove bit collars using the bit collar installation tool included in the toolkit for the Carvera Air. And these bit collars can also be purchased in our store and installed on bits sourced from anywhere that you'd like. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe. And of course, stay tuned for more how-tos, tutorials, and guides on our YouTube channel and Wiki site.